Good morning, I hope everybody's okay. So, we're gonna be traveling again. Don't forget to like and subscribe and thank you ever so much for watching us on the channel and supporting us. Well, so no more, let's travel. Now here's the thing, if you wish to do, you can actually go on a restaurant cruise, which, uh, cruise in the canals, which is not a bad idea. Uh, I certainly wouldn't mind doing that, but um, <clears throat> unfortunately, I think they are booked out uh, quite a bit in advance. Now, here we go. Here's an interesting thing. You've got the Jubilee Pavilion here as uh, part of a worldwide celebration of William Shakespeare, the absolute writing, playwright genius. And he's been standing here for about, uh, let's say, 153 years after his death, but they did originally uh, erect a, a form of memorial, which was like a, a, venue, a main venue for three days three days uh, for Shakespeare Jubilee Festival here in uh, stratford upon avon so it's really good. Well here we are outside the RSC Theatre in uh, stratford upon avon I keep saying that stratford upon avon but this is so crucial being an old actor myself this is quite a good place to be. the actual writings of uh, William Shakespeare. In that time, there wasn't really... There, yes, of course, there, there were playwrights, but not to, to a level of this. Um, there was a certain amount of fantasy in early sort of playwrights. Uh, they came up with their own mystical worlds and things like that. But at least the thing with William Shakespeare, he got down to the, dare I say, the bare bones of everything and he was very much a person for bringing things out into the open. Now, William Shakespeare is actually laid to rest in uh, the Trinity Church, the Holy Trinity Church, which we're just going to go and see. We might be able to film from the outside. I'm not sure whether we're going to be able to go inside, but uh, let's go and have a look anyway.
There are so many, many, many old buildings here. And unfortunately, there's my map direction thing going off there. Um, they're closed. But you can still look at them from the outside. You get a good idea of what's inside as well. Well, here I am now, in the grounds of the church, Holy Trinity Church, where William Shakespeare is actually buried. Now, I've stopped off here, not only to have a rest, but to uh, think to uh, let you know, basically, the things that are happening with the channel. We are starting to pick up. Uh, we also had an award today with regards to uh, Google Google Maps, the things that we've done on Google Maps, which is quite good. They gave us an award for having one million views, I think, of photographs which were on their site as a part of being a Google guide. So, so that was good. The, the channels, I'm not gonna bore you for too long. The channel is moving on a lot now. We do actually have a lot of views, not many subscribers, hint, hint. But we are pleased with the way that we are going and all about Thailand as well. The uh, thing we've got going with the podcast, that's going really well and everything else like that. So we'll take a little bit of a rest here and then we're going to go and have a look around the outside of the church. things that we uh, can't do at the moment but uh, you, you get a good idea of uh, the things that are going on and how that church is and it's a shame we can't have a look inside but, uh, there you go. no doubt we will one day and if walking is your thing there are plenty of really sort of memorable walks along by the river which is just perfect Well, that was a very, very good day. As you can see, we're now back to the hotel. I'm going to uh, get my feet up and uh, edit this video. So, take care from all of us. Uh, like we always say, stay safe. Love you all.